What's up, fight fans? This is Kirk DeVille with Counter Punch Boxing News, and I have some new news concerning Terrence Bud Crawford. Terrence Bud Crawford took to social media with this caption, and he said, quote, Okay, y'all, I'm over at Twin Charlo. He's no longer on my hit list. He went out there and laid down and let Canelo spank him like he was his daddy with no type of resistance with the crying emoji. <laughs> and let me counterpunch. Uh, you know, a lot of people have been disappointed with Jamel. And, you know, a lot of people are pissed off. I've seen some videos about that. Like, oh, well, why don't he fight Jamel? He said he would fight Jamel. You know, but, yeah, he wanted to fight Jamel when only in the picture was Errol and Jermail because they were by the same coach and Jermail was capping shit. That's how that be started, right? And since he was doing that, he told he told Jermail like, "Well, you're a fake individual, and as soon as I whoop Errol Spence, I'll come whoop you." But what did Jermail do? Jermail Charlo went to challenge Canelo Alvarez, okay, at a weight class two higher, two weight classes higher. And so Terrence Crawford then up the stakes. Okay, fine. Now, I'll fight the winner of those two. Okay, so if he can beat Can uh, Canelo Alvarez, all right, well, we won't have to worry about Canelo, will we? Especially beating him in his own weight. So then he could fight. But Jermel went up there and pulled the damn survival tactic. He didn't even try to win. That's what the message was about. Okay, because he was like, okay, well, he spanked you like he was his daddy, and you didn't even try to win. So you ask yourself, like, okay, well, you know, why would I fight him? People, why would Terrence Crawford fight Jermel Charlo now? Why would he? It would be different if, if Terrence was, 20, or was, thir was 25, 32, you know what I mean? Terrence Crawford is 36 years old. Why would he be wasting time fighting the loser out of those two guys. Now, if Canelo doesn't fight him, okay, saying that's not worth it, I won't get credit for fighting him, okay, then it's considerable. Like, okay, I get it then. Now you may want to consider fighting Jamel, but, you know, if anything, you know, um, Terrence Crawford has Errol Spence to fight. He has already a fight, right? So we like to think. You know what I mean? Because, you know, of that weight difference and stuff like that. But, yeah. Um, I think Terrence Crawford is interested in fighting winners, not the guy that lost. You know what I mean? So it would make more sense to put more energy into fighting Canelo simply because that's the guy that won. He's the cash cow, so the money's there, too. So it's a win-win. You know, he's younger. Um He's bigger, okay? And a lot of people think he's one of the best pound for pound, which we all know Terrence Bud Crawford is. I believe he is. So if anything, I, I say to uh, people that think Terrence Crawford's wrong for dissing Jamel, no, it's just the way Jamel went out there and destroyed it. His performance showed that, well, we don't think you'll beat Terrence Crawford if you went in there to only survive against Canelo Alvarez. And that's exactly what I've seen him do. <clears throat> See, what difference would it be? First of all, I think Jamel would probably fight uh, Terrence differently. I think he would fight him to win, you know. But but then, you know, if you could get a Canelo and Terrence Crawford fight, it's a bigger fight. So if you're Terrence Crawford, what would you really do? You know, you showed up at a fight to see a guy that you're supposed to fight show up not to fight. You know, so... I don't blame Terrence Crawford, and I understand where he's coming from. You know, you don't get the rights to fight another guy or the champion. It doesn't matter what weight class is he in, you know, especially an undefeated guy like Terrence Crawford, which is older than both of those guys, and then expect him to still have the same value or the same energy or desire to fight you after you go up and pull up and then show, show up and then show out. OK, but anyway, you guys tell me what you think of Terrence Crawford now booting 
Jermail Charlo out of the equation, out of the possibility of wanting fighting him, of course, please subscribe. And you guys been counterpunch. Peace.